Hey everybody, welcome back to Minor Stuff. I'm Matt. I'm Pat. And we're the Minor Brothers. Brothers. Today we're doing our review of Old Forester 117, the Fire Series. Let's get into it. Alright, welcome back everybody. Before we get started, do that good stuff of smashing that like button for us. Uh, subscribe to this channel. Check out all the other cool stuff we're bringing you. Hit that notification bell. Help us out, continue to grow, and uh, work that algorithm for us. Uh, Matt, super excited to try this one. Yeah. Old Forester 117 series. The Whiskey Row Fire. Yes. So this started from the uh, the fire they actually had down at, down on Whiskey Row. Firefighters were able to go in, put a good stop on it, save some, you know, save some barrels and stuff. And so they made this out of it. And it was a release in, um, down in Kentucky. It was also an online release. We were able to, luck or I should say, he was able, luckily, to get one. He said, hey, buddy, hurry up. By the time I literally clicked the link, tried to add to cart, already gone. So these things went fast. Super fast. However, we were able to get a bottle. Um, it is, what, seven years? Yep. 100 proof. Uh, so let's see what it has to bring to us. Very, very, like, light, Ooh. airy nose to it. Very light nose. I'm getting vanilla. Right off the bat, like, that's hitting me. Yep. I'm getting, like, a sweet uh, honey as well. Am I picking up on, like, some hints of cherry, maybe? There's something like that in there. It's so light, it's... It is, it's a very, very light nose, which is, it's surprising. I was figuring it would have been a... I mean, definitely got the vanilla, you got the oak... I'm definitely getting and honey, honey, and there's yep. that something else. It really does. It's like a faint and, cherry to yeah. me. Yeah. Let's get into this bad boy. Ooh. Wow. That's yummy. That's good. <laughs> that is <laughs> that is really, really good. Brown sugar. Very noticeable with the vanilla. Berries, very berry. Yeah, I was gonna say fruity. Yep, it's I, I, I am a fan. I wish I wish I could have got some bottles because that like berry flavor that's coming through, it it's mm. sitting on my tongue and dancing. It, it's amazing. It after the berries go away, that that berry I'm gonna call it fruit because I think it was more fruity to me. Um, it, honey and vanilla last and stay. It's very, very nice. It is for finish. me. The, that berry flavor is sitting on my tongue. It's still sitting on my tongue. It's great. Mm. This is like, like, I love a lot of Buffalo Trace, like the stag. You I pick up on a lot of that cherry stuff. But this is not cherries. This is more of a berry to me. Mm. And it is also freaking phenomenal. Like, yeah, that is delicious. That is really good. Like, I really, I wish I could have got a lot more bottles of this because. This is something I would drink the crap out of, like, every single day if I could. This would be a daily drinker for me if we had enough of it. Like, it's that good to me. Yeah, it is fantastic. It's not, Absolutely it's fantastic. not overpowering on the proof. It's 100 proof. It drinks, it feels to me like it's drinking a little bit stronger than 100. It does feel stronger, Like, yeah. you do, like, that, that little bit of, like, you know, spice on the initial part of it, whatever, is it feels, like, a stronger than 100, but it's not, it's not overpowering. Yeah. But for me, that berry flavor... You know, mixed in with that vanilla and stuff is just, it's hitting the spot. Mm, absolutely mm. amazing. Yeah, that is, that bottle's fire. That's what that is. Yeah. That is a good bottle. And it sucks that they're, they're doing 375s. Well, I mean, it came in, it, I got two 375s when I bought it, when I bought it online. Still, so. just do the 750s. Yeah. I mean, it, it looks cool. It's like a little mini bottle, but like 750s, hook this stuff up on the regular because I'd buy the crap out of it. Yeah, it's good. amazing. I'm a huge Old Forester fan anyways, but, and usually I think more Old Forester, we get a lot more like banana stuff. Banana notes, yeah. yeah. And this is not, this is more berry forward. Straight up fire. Um, yeah. But yeah, absolutely great. So if you can find a bottle of this stuff somewhere, I would say buy it, I and mean, the chances of, of finding one is probably slim to none. We're still going to look for more, especially after tasting it. I want another one. Um, but other than that, we hope you guys like our review of the uh, 117 series here. And follow us along for other man shit. Have a good day.